Hello, my name is Dan Ryan. I'm a candidate for position two for Portland City Council. And my passion for Southeast Portland began really for me when I was um, on the school board. I really fell for the elementary schools in the area, Lewis, Whitman, uh, and also the, the, let's see, the middle school, Lane Middle School and the Learning Gardens near there. So I always liked um, the green spaces out here and the fact that they had learning gardens for the children. And it made me realize there was a nice vibe out here in Southeast Portland. I find the neglect that, that occurs in these outer neighborhoods, I can identify with it because I was born and raised in North Portland and outer North Portland was always neglected historically um, and forever um, with sidewalks not being paved, potholes or streets that aren't even, that are dirt still, that are side streets that a lot of us have to use. And so I think being in outer North Portland, I've always identified when you get to the outer reaches of Southeast. I think in particular right now with, um, in the city of Portland, we have three major crises going on and everyone's talking about them and it's how we're gonna take action. And the three crises of course are housing, homelessness and transportation. And so when I think about what's happening, it's like for 25 years, we were just doing things the same way. And that's what got us here. We knew for decades, all these people were gonna to move to Portland. And the good news is they showed up. That's great for our economy. The bad news is we never kept up with our housing stock. So our housing stock has remained about 80% of what's needed. That's gonna be a lever on, on expense. And then we always have these projections of what's gonna happen here. I can see what's happened in inner north and northeast Portland, where now they're called historic neighborhoods because basically it's been gentrified and displaced. And that makes me sad. And it's gonna probably happen out here unless we take real action. So displacement of multi-generational families and elders just isn't okay. You should be able to age appropriately in your home and in the community that you've given to. And so as a city council member, I'll be a fierce advocate for protecting those residents that are here and that care for this land. I think it's also really important as we look at the density that will come is that we take care of the precious green spaces you have in outer Southeast Portland and you have some of the best in the city. And so I want to make sure that we also really um, improve our, our park system out in Southeast Portland. But the truth is we're just in a, in a, a housing crisis and there's going to be um, more housing built out here, but it's how can we share the space? And more importantly, how can we make sure we have restrictions that keep people in place? And so I don't wanna see what happened in inner north and northeast Portland to neighborhoods like this in outer southeast Portland. We owe it to the community and we owe it to the new residents as well. And we all can come together and, and, and do something different. And the status quo is just hasn't been getting it right for decades. I bring a different approach. I'm a bridge builder. I'm known for bringing different communities together that have never worked together on problems. And these are complex. So we need real community solutions. And those don't, those don't land in City Hall. They're out there, they're out in our neighborhoods. I'm delighted to be here tonight and to learn more about the neighborhood and I'm ready to serve. Thank you.